All right. So for the second also option, which I already explained a little bit earlier, so this one is very, very interesting because it go along with the audio and the video. So let's start with that. So you click on your share a resources photo or articles. All right. So now we want to share this here. Uh, or a visual activity to the class called a gss2 com class so now you can see under here we have a two option here you click the one that have icon of a camera so when you click on, when you click on it to give you two options there is it a picture or camera option that i want to work with so we now say that i want to work with a picture option you click on picture option uh, camera option sorry so we and here now also have a two activity, a two option here to work with the image or video. So now we want to go with the video, so I can go with the voice and a video also. So now let's easily click on a video aspect. <coughs> As I said earlier, we should make sure that the video is not more than one minute. If it took more than one minute, it should not be more than a two minutes for easy access by the group or by the classes now let me just say uh, really give uh, a simple video conversation let me turn the camera to myself all right thank you my fellow colleagues here is the video very short very easy so now i'll start the Recording aspect. Just click on the recording here, pointing. Thank you. The video has started recording now. So you can see here, with this now, the student can be easily assess your voice and your video file. Right now. So by seeing you, I also give them a, an instruction to be also more interesting for them to listen and concentrate on your class but in mind as i said earlier don't allow the, the file to be too heavy but when you have enough uh, file or uh, too heavy to very hard for for it to upload from your file from your device to the platform and at the other end also which is the student or the client group end it will be difficult for them also to download those files into their system so what i mean is that you should make sure that it should not be more than one minute if it if possible that it's going to be more than one minute it should not exist two minutes maximum two minutes so now we can work with this uh, video thank you let's see how we can send this one now to the platform you can see saving file so now in this option here you can see here we have a uh, two option here said i want to play it or want to re-record and if you want to record you can click on that that icon here if you want to play the file and see how it is you can click here and, and play it so in that down here you can see cancel and uh, mark a uh, sign here so these two signs here the first one here is that if you want to cancel the video when you want to record another one or go to cancel and go to another platform you can cancel it why the mark here if you want to accept this file as your uh, visual file you can accept it so you can go to that platform now let's click on that mark sign but want to accept this file you can see now so you allow it to load you can see it's loading so once it's load finished you will not see this uh, sign that's rolling around the play symbol let's wait a little bit let it finish loading you can see how long it takes now so the heavier the file the longer time it takes so it also depends on your network. If, the, if your network, uh, the area you are living in and the network is not that good, you also have this uh, challenge. So make sure that the file is not too heavy. Once the file is too heavy, you have an issue of uploading it. And at the back side also, which is uh, the student side also, if their also network is also the same slow as our, as yours, so you also have uh, the same problem. So the good access is to make sure the file is very short. The uh, information there is very short. So it will be easily accessed by the student. So now you can see it has already loaded. I get now. So it's fully loaded now. So for us to send now, just write a, a simple word here. Make sure you write something on top of the file here. You can just tap up top here and write something. Here, just write. Here, 
is is here is our class conversation here is the hmm, let me put it here is our next class okay so i'll just put it right here is our next class here activity activities so once you have done that you can easily come here and send it to the platform You can see now the file be sent here. Here is the file. So here are the two ways you can easily do such here. I think it's very very interesting. When the students see it, they are very very appreciative. And even the group also love it the way it is. Thank you. And please don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much. I appreciate you.